Okay, so recently I've been interested in playing Souls-like games on Roblox, and today I've gathered two of these Souls-like Roblox games that I feel like are the best examples. And to start off, we have Roll Souls 3. Now this game was made by Sin Incorporated alongside some other developers, and currently this game is just in its beta stage. And boys, we are here in our first game, which is Roll Souls 3. I honestly love the description of this game. Arise, arise, fail as many times as you needed to prevail. Which is very inspired, you know, you never give up. So, let's go to this uh, load button over here. And okay, um, I'm white. Or, wait, no, I'm gray. I think I just broke it up from, like, this coffin thingy over here. Also, it looks like I can actually punch in this game. Maybe there's a heavy attack or something, I don't know. If you hold down the spacebar button, you actually sprint. But if you click it one time, you roll. Also, what is this thing here? Is this a weapon or something? Oh! Let's punch him. Let's back up. No, oh, very easy to kite out. Look at that. Oh, never mind. I say that as I get uh, as I get sliced by him. Please die. Okay, can I loot this guy's body by any chance? I don't think so. Oh my goodness. If I'm trying to do a no hit run, I'm failing right now. I'm guessing this an NPC who might talk to you, or um, just a long sword. Yes. So let's just jack it from that guy. Let's go to our equipment over here. Equip these things. Here's this guy. Let's try to lock on to him. Let's try to evade him first. Ooh! Wait, I actually one-shot that guy! Okay, say no more. That was actually kind of sick. We can one-shot all these people. Let's just keep uh, going up ahead. Okay, is this like a Lost Grace or like Bonfire or something? Yes, Kindle Bonfire. Bonfire lit. So let's rest. Get some more HP. There's travel here. I'm guessing that's like to like fast travel and stuff. A tune spell. Obviously, we don't have any spells. We don't have that much storage. Also, wait, what is this? Is this like a boss fight or something? Let me see. Oh god, enter the fog. Might be a boss fight. Oh, yep, yeah, she looks like a boss. Let's try to lock on to this guy. We're not gonna hit him yet. We're gonna try to see this guy's attack pattern, right? Okay, that's like a long swing-ish. Ooh, we dodged that. Oh, we gotta dodge that. You guys, we're trying to do a no-hit run. Also, why am I panic rolling so hard right now? Oh, what? Bro, who are you? Okay, that's actually kind of sick. And we just kill him like that. Okay, cool. And I got a badge. Okay, well, that was actually kind of nice. It would be nice if there was also like a bonfire or a lost that kind of spawns from here. But that's okay. Let's just go over here. And actually, wait, the bonfire is over in this direction. You know what? That's fine. These guys are still one-shottable. There's also one down there, so let's go this way. Wonder we can try to sneak up on this guy. Nice. Okay, let's just go up these steps. And also, I think that's a skeleton right there. And let me guess, I do not one-shot this person. Or maybe I do. Dude, whatever the sword is, it might be OP. Anyway, this is actually some loot, a chest. Hopefully it's not like a fake chest or like a trap chest or anything. Oh, and I got some more like master helmet and stuff. Might be better armor than the one that I have right now. Let's actually see. I think this armor might be worse. I actually like my old armor better. And this time, let's keep on sticking to the left side here. This guy does not notice us. Huh? Oh, what? Wait. Bro, some random dog. Bro, this random dog that's made out of bones just came out of nowhere. Travel to Firelink Shrine. Let's do that. Okay, guys, we're making progress right now. I'm guessing I have to speak to this, uh, one guy down there. That's our objective right now. Okay, yes. Hello there, sir. Travel to the high wall of Lothric. A few moments later. Alright, where are we? Where are these naked people? They might be our enemy, because I can lock onto them. Yes, let's, uh, let's just do that. Okay, high wall of Lothric. Which way should we go? To the right side or maybe to the left side? Which, there's actually a guy right there. I still one-shot these people, that's crazy insane. I two-shot that doggo though. They actually do a pretty good amount of damage as well. So that's to be careful, dude! That guy came from the ground or something. Oh, and who are you? Nah, dodge that, what? Dodge that! I'm so bad at dodge! And here we go, this guy again, round two. Okay, cool. That's when I can attack him. 
Nice. Why am I so... Round three, or like four or five. I actually, I, I actually lost track. Nice! Oh my goodness, we finally got him. We finally got that guy. After like, what, six tries or something? Dude. Oh! Let's just equip it right now. I think it might be better than the one that we have like right now. Dude, this is actually kind of sick. These guys did not notice me. But I'm gonna kill them. Bro, can I attack this person? I cannot click! My, my mouth cannot click! Um, hello, game! Oh my goodness, bro. Am I, am I doing damage to this person? Dude. Bro, is he got, like, friendly with me or something? What's happening? Yeah, let's go, like, this way or something. Try to find another bonfire to reset the... Reset this thing. Okay, there's a hole here. I'm guessing I have to jump down it. Oh, God. Can I get this person? Oh, it's like the last time, and, and I just died. Okay, cool. Alrighty, so Rose Souls 3. Overall, I'll say this game is very solid for a Souls-like Roblox game. The biggest thing I enjoyed was definitely the boss fight that we had. The only thing I didn't enjoy was some of the glitches I ran into, which is fine, because this game's still in beta. But overall, I had to rate this game. I'll give it a solid 7.5 out of 10. But that moves us on to our next game, which is called Nameless. This game is developed by a studio called From Blocks, where and at the moment, this game's only a demo. And fun fact, this game was made within a week. But anyways guys, we are here in the game right now. And okay, donate leaderboard. I should click on the play button. And okay, looks like I have some sort of like a pylon or like triangle on my head. And it was a sword right here, like a Zwayhander or whatever you call it. But okay, but wait, so let's uh, traverse the mist. I'm guessing we're just headed straight to a boss fight, which I kind of like. Oh, never mind, I had to wake this guy first. Oh, I ate that. I ate that again. I have a lot of range, though. Oh, shoot. Let me heal here. I think I try to bait out this guy's attack, right? That's a big charge attack by him. He can actually, like, dodge that or something. Ouch. Okay, never mind. We did not dodge that. I think we just died. Okay, cool. Let's try to do this thing one more time. Or like a few more times, I mean. Hit him once, then let's back up. Let's get back. Nice dodge. We can actually attack him here. Oh, never mind, we cannot attack him there. I think he's the type of boss where you have to wait for him to attack first, right? I just had to, what, dodge out. Okay, there we go. This boss is actually easier than I, uh, than I thought. Ooh! That was a bad attack by me. I should stop rolling in. I should just like sprint inside like so. Nice. Attack, then we back up. Oh, that's the second phase, I think. Oh, what? Damn, that's like a one shot right there. Dude, that's like a one shot right there. Dude, why did I not think that there would not be a second phase? I should always assume that there was a second phase. Nice phase two. Oh wow, that almost one shot us. Nah, it's over. It's actually over. Nice, it's over. Let's go, boys. Let's go! Nameless. Dude, what a good game. That was actually a really good boss fight. Holy. Okay, Nameless. If I have to be honest, this is a great Souls-like demo. Now, obviously, there's only a boss fight, and I'll say it's pretty fun. I have to say, it isn't that hard to beat the boss, but I would say the fight is just very long. Just like the last game, I love how the boss fight had a second phase to it. 
and honestly I don't dislike anything about the game. Maybe there was a bit more content besides the boss fight, or maybe the boss had more movesets. But overall, if I had to rate this game, I'll give it a solid 8.5 out of 10.